so yes please don't judge i'm yet to have my bath i reached here yesterday in the evening around 5 pm and today is the 22nd of august 2018 and i am so excited to be here this place this view to be here it is always nice to be in thailand because it is a place full of culture there is oneness that i see around and that's the fun most part of it and of course i always feel welcomed they always have smiles when they look at me and i smile back i like to smile and this is one place where i really get an opportunity to smile at anybody and everybody strangers and even tourists for sure i cannot be carrying my dj osmo all the way to my trip in thailand and not be recording vlogs from here i will have to utilize and make sure that i use it for sure let's start with the second day 22nd of august 2018 it was a wednesday and this trip is mostly about shopping for me i think the majority of the things that i have done and i would like to do during this trip is shopping i have seen it has been my observation in the last 3 thailand tours that the clothes here are of better quality even if i buy a t-shirt which is the same price even after conversion as here back home the quality here is slightly better the cloth is very soft the cloth is nice and the material is very good it lasts for long the color lasts for long and even if it is non branded so even if i buy something say a t-shirt or a shorts worth rupees 400 there and 200 baht here the one here is of slightly better quality and of course the make is also different people in different regions wear different types of clothes and the shorts in india that i get or in pune are slightly different from the shorts that i get here and the like i like the shorts here because they are really short and they are nice and i like to wear them i'm too sleepy right now but let me just quickly continue to talk about this mbk center ke baad of course i again did some shopping in at mbk center and bought a few souvenirs bought a few clothes for myself again and again the money that i took out completely spent from there i went to the sala dying station where i walked down towards the lumpini park that was one pending place for me that was one um, place that i really really wanted to go i had researched it in 2013 itself but then i didn't get an opportunity to go there in my last three trips and today i was i was so glad to be there i went there a bit late i think i reached around 6:30 pm it was still bright but it was towards the end of the day if it were brighter maybe around 4 5 pm i would have walked around and i was so tired from all the walking that i did in the mbk center that i didn't really walk in the lumpini park i just went there and sat and chilled for a little while and just did a little self talk a little meditation and basically quiet in my mind self talk is also second quieting comes first so I did that and i was super duper exhausted it started raining the moment i sat in the train back to ratchapra road there is no direct train from sala dying i went to national stadium to from sala dying i went to siam then changed the train that goes towards mochit and got down at phaya thai phaya thai and from there bought another ticket for uh, to catch the airport link 
from Piyathai to Ratchapra road and it was heavily raining and I just waited for a while and I saw a train crossing right on the road there are some railways I love the railways that that walk on the road how do you say that I am too sleepy right now I think so it was fun to come down come back in rains and I came to the room I was super exhausted took a little shower and recorded a couple of more musically clicked a few photos as well and photos to bahut kheche hain mere I have been uploading them backing them up on Google photos and I really look forward to what tomorrow has to offer to me I'm sitting under a light not in front of a light so the lighting is slightly weird i may be appearing yellow but i hope this is good enough i think fair enough let me just move ahead a little bit there you go slightly better probably i'll move there shortly near the bed where there is a good lamp and i'll be much better visible right after the platinum fashion mall shopping i went downstairs to the ground floor there was a burger king that i saw and i had a veg burger there it's it's fun to have burgers any any time but then yahan par since of course there are indian restaurants right below this hotel plenty of them but i don't know why mujhe yahan pe aake इंडियन खाना इडली सांबर या पाव भाजी खाने में मज़ा नहीं आता नॉट दैट आई ईट द स्टफ दैट इज थाई स्पेशल आई एम वेरी बैड वेन इट कम्स टू फूड बिकॉज आई एम अ वेजिटेरियन आई डोंट इवन हैव एग्स सो इट्स क्वाइट डिफिकल्ट फॉर मी आई लाइक टू ईट फ्रूट्स टू बी एबल टू ईट अ वाटर मेलन इन ऑगस्ट इज ऑसम नॉट दैट यू डोंट गेट इट इन पुणे बट देन यहाँ पर एकदम ईजीली मिलता है इवन मैंगो ऑरेंज and the fruits are very sweet and very nice so besides that i had a burger at burger king and it was fun before that i had of course had a burger at burger king in pune before this but before that i had had a burger at burger king in chiang mai when i was uh, there for two months so on one or two days i think i went to the uh, to the burger king there and had a vegetarian burger it was fun i was having soft drinks at that time and yesterday i didn't i did not have a soft drink because i wanted to have coffee with that said i'm not saying that you don't get good clothes in india of course you do but i'm speaking very generally here generally the clothes the types of clothes that i like to wear i get a lot of variety here different kinds of fashion and it's it's nice to wear some different clothing for sure of course back home i just keep buying clothes like a crazy person but to come here and do that is definitely different but that's the only thing that i've been doing on the 22nd of august my plan was to go to the platinum fashion mall and just hang around there it's a beautiful mall it's a magnificent huge mall from the bayok sky hotel there's a shortcut that opens up directly to the platinum fashion mall I was exploring uh, my mobile actually doesn't really work I didn't buy a sim card here because I have wifi here so I don't want to be connected all the time it's good to be offline at times for sure barring a few times when you actually want to post something or record vlogs or post life hacks so I was just exploring yahi ghoom raha tha niche aur ek gali dikhi mujhe उस गली से मैं बाहर निकला तो अचानक प्लेटिनम फैशन मॉल आई वाज लाइक वाओ दिस इज व्हाट आई वांटेड बिकॉज दैट्स अ मॉल व्हिच हैज स्टफ स्लाइटली बेटर देन चाटू चाक मार्केट 
again comparison here a shots that i get at 200 baht there is probably 220 baht here but then it's of better quality for sure so a few things here and there of course now you cannot really guarantee and write down ki okay yahi pe best milega but then you explore and that is like a one shop stop and you get all kinds of clothing that you want it's mostly for women a lot of section for women and a lot of clothes for women but then there is a floor for men as well where i went to later it is enjoyable buying clothes is always enjoyable and to get that stuff here to go to that mall to enjoy to buy is so much fun